Welcome to Active English Training. My name is Ingrid and this picture description is of a busy city street. It's part of a series of one minute picture descriptions with the topic advantages and disadvantages of city versus country life. To practice, play the description part of the video three times. The first time just listen and connect what you hear with the images on the photo and the second and third time speak along aloud. This speak along will help you activate and expand your active vocabulary and improve your speaking skills. So let's start. In this picture, you can see a busy street in a town or city. There are a lot of people heading all in one direction. Maybe they just got off the underground and now they're heading to work or home. Some people are carrying shopping bags, so maybe they did some quick grocery shopping on the way home, maybe grab something for dinner or lunch. From the way people are dressed, I think they're all like business people or working adults. I don't really see any teenagers or families. It seems to be in the rush hour in the morning or late afternoon when people are heading to or back home from their offices, stores or other businesses they work for. On the right hand side, you can also see a lot of shop fronts and in the background further back, though it's a little blurry, but you can see some high rise office buildings on the left. There seems to be a street market, as you can see a stall selling T-shirts with large prints for tourists. I'm sure there are lots of other stalls selling different stuff such as food, secondhand clothes, maybe homemade produce or maybe handmade jewelry, things like that. This looks like a typical lively and vibrant street scene in the city or town center. I think living in the city is great if you like a vibrant and lively atmosphere with many shops and restaurants and street cafes and street markets, maybe street music and festivals all within walking distance and also culturally diverse people from all around the world and all walks of life to mix and mingle with. Public transport is another plus, of course. You can just hop on a bus or the tube to get to places very quickly and also buses and the underground they run every couple of minutes and you don't need a car you don't need to worry about driving on a friday or saturday night out you can just hop on a on the tube and and get home and i think it might be also easier to meet people because there are so many events and places and activities where people come together however from my own experience having lived in big cities such as london um, there's also a lot of stress, um, the rush of crowded streets and overcrowded subways can also really be quite stressful. And I'm not sure if people have the time or take the time to chat to the people and try to get to know and make friends uh, with all these people they meet in their daily lives in the city. There's also, of course, more noise and more air pollution and fewer green spaces and other factors that can affect people's well-being and be quite, you know, stressful. Although I live in the country, I live very close to a bigger town and maybe just 10 minutes um, on the bike. And I do love the hustle and bustle of the city, the vibrancy on a summer's day, and I need my regular dose of it. Uh, as long as I can get back to the peace and quiet of my countryside home. And yeah, so what about you? City or countryside life? What do you prefer?